Hello there, this is the Bookkeeper Master on YouTube. Welcome to another free Sage tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to briefly go over age creditors, what age creditors is, and the different reports that can be run on Sage for aged creditors. This is for Sage 50 Cloud and Sage 50 Accounts. So we go to the suppliers module, which is the purchase ledger. Here is our list of suppliers. And on many of these supplier accounts, there are balances. These balances are the money that's owed to these suppliers. They're purchase invoices that are either due or overdue for payment. They are age creditors. So the money owed to suppliers can be referred to as overdue purchase invoices or supplier invoices owed. But the official term of the amount collectively is aged creditors. So these are aged creditors, money owed to suppliers. So there are a few reports that you can run. First of all, if you wanted to see what a supplier owes, if you just highlight the supplier, such as Essex Supplies, and click on Activity, you have an activity of their account, all the transactions, all the activity on this account. If you click on this OS only, it will show only outstanding transactions so outstanding only so we can see we have this invoice 42101 O to Essex supplies which is the balance in their account if I leave this as ticked and then click on the activity of the other I can tick it again once again it shows us which invoices are outstanding so that's the first way that you can see what is outstanding to each of your suppliers by using this OS outstanding only box. Same thing can happen with customers. Go to the customer module and click on OS only. You can see which specific invoices are owed by which customer in the activity tab. The next thing you can do is run this aged balances report. So if I click on aged balances, it will come up with a report on screen that shows the balance on each of the suppliers accounts and how old the balances are so we have bookkeeping master supply here the balance in their account is 10,200 6,000 of that is current so that doesn't need paying yet 4,200 of that amount is overdue by one month so we have our one month two month and three month overdue columns we even have an older column you can see there are some figures showing the older column. So these invoices are very, very overdue. They either need paying immediately or perhaps there's some sort of dispute or error on the account that needs correcting. So this is the age balances feature. You just simply click on age balances and the report will run. Now, sometimes you might run the report and it only brings one account up. That's because an account is highlighted. So whatever accounts you highlight, from the list and then run age balances those accounts only will show will show on this report we can clear that off by clicking clear and you can select multiple suppliers by holding down control just like you would do in excel or other software another report you can run is an age creditors report so if we go to reports at the top right click on age creditors there is an age creditors summary. Let's just scroll through. Yep, so we have age creditors summary. If I star this report, it will then show my favorites. So age creditors summary. If we run this report, this is a printable report. It also can be emailed and it shows what the age balances show, but in a printable version. So once again, we have each supplier with the balance and how old each of those balances are. If you need something a bit more detailed, then under age creditors again, so this is still in the reports feature, there's an age creditors detailed. So let's find age creditors detailed. This one, let me star that. So we have age creditors detailed. This will show the same information, but it will break down which invoices are actually due or outstanding so we have 
Bookkeeper Master Supply, we don't just have the balance on their account as a total. We have what that balance consists of. So we have two invoices here. So this is a much more detailed report, as the name suggests, Age Creditors Analysis Detailed Report. So this report gives you a list of all the due and overdue invoices, all the outstanding invoices on the supplier's accounts.